is your back to school station and today marks the first day of school for parts of the peninsula and northeastern North Carolina. Casey Baylor has the early start to a new school year. A sea of backpacks and smiling faces return to many schools in Hampton Roads. School staff in places like Newport News and Hampton greeted students with signs as they entered the building Monday morning. Me, my day. Many students like Peyton Rose are excited about the new year. Others are ready to show off their new school gear. And I got the unicorn backpack. And parents on the peninsula have mixed emotions about dropping their students off. I am uh, uh, hoping for a safe and productive year for two of my kids. Yes, we are so excited. I'm sad, but it's okay. It's bittersweet. Kate Ford says her daughter couldn't wait for her second year of preschool. She's been itching to get back to school all summer. She was talking about missing her friends. Ford says the excitement had her up early. Uh, we didn't sleep last night because she was too excited. She woke up at 3.30 and she told me that her glasses were on and she was ready to start her day. <laughs> and this school year is much different than years prior. School leaders in Newport News and in Hampton decided to start the school year a week earlier than normal. According to leaders with the Newport News Public Schools Division, the early heads start allows teachers to address student learning gaps and end the school year early. I'm Casey Baylor for 13 News Now. Southside school divisions including Norfolk, Portsmouth and Chesapeake will head back to the classroom a week from tomorrow on September 6th. Now we want to see those first day of school pictures so far. Oh. Oh. <laughs> so cute. Oh my God. A few of them have been sent in. We've oh created a post gosh. on our social media you guys account. They look so good. They look so great. Oh man. Continue to send these our way, and you might see your pictures on air here on 13 News Now. Have a great Seriously. year at school.